How to make great downloadable PDFs. Some notes on optimizing and pre-flight. There are three things you should do to ensure the highest quality of your PDF before upload. We recommend that you optimize. We have recommended settings for optimizing your PDF, which I'll cover in a moment. And once you've entered these settings in the optimization menu, you can save them to use again and again. We recommend that you pre-flight, and Acrobat makes this very easy. And for digital PDFs, pre-flight is only needed to ensure the files RGB color as opposed to CMYK, which is used for print only. And then test your file. Test it on different platforms, on handhelds, and to make sure everything's working properly before you upload. Let's open up a PDF and ha have a look at how to do each. Optimization. Now there is something to note here about optimization. It can cause some issues with linked and bookmarked files. If you have already linked and or bookmarked your file, you might want to skip this step unless you've had issues and it needs to be done. To optimize, select Optimize PDF from the tool menu on the right hand side of the page. Then select Advanced Optimization. Now let's go through each of the tools for the settings. Make it compatible with 6.0 and higher. For your images, you want bicubic downsampling of 150 ppi for images above 225 ppi, using the compression for JPEG and at medium quality. You want this exact same setting for your grayscale images. For your monochrome images, you want to set it to bicubic downsampling, 300 ppi for images above 450, and the compression set to CCITT group 4. Make sure that optimize images only if there's a reduction in size is not checked. Under fonts, this is one of the quick ones, simply click do not unembed any font. Transparency, also a quick and easy. Just select medium resolution. For discard objects, simply click discard all alternate images and detect and merge image fragments. Under discard user data, Simply click Discard Hidden Layer Content and Flatten Visible Layers. If you are using layers in your PDF, be sure not to tick this box. And then for cleanup, select Optimize the PDF for Fast Web View and make sure you have selected Compress Entire File for your Object Compression option. If this is not an option, you should still be able to compress the document structure. Once this is all set, you can click Save and save this for future use. Then click OK. It'll ask you to resave the file, and we recommend that you save under a different name to avoid any complications if something goes wrong while optimizing. It'll take a couple minutes to process, and it'll save in the file where you put it. It's quick and easy. Now let's look at pre-flighting. To pre-flight, open the print production menu and select pre-flight. You can close the, pre the print menu once you have pre-flight open. And you're just going to go under profiles under the mechanic setting and convert all pages to RGB images and preserve text information. Then you're going to click analyze and fix. Again, it'll ask you to save the file and we still recommend you rename the file when you save so you don't save over the original. It'll take a few minutes depending on the size of the book, and that's it. Once you have run all your tests, and once you have run all your checks, make sure to test your file. If you have any bookmarks, you're going to want to check and make sure all your bookmarks are still working. If you had link links in your file, you want to check and make sure all your links are still working. Check it on your computer, check it on your handhelds, check it on anything else you need to check it on. And then feel free to go ahead and upload. Thank you for your time.